Saturday, the 15th of August, 2020. A reading from the prophet Ezekiel, chapters 18, 1 to 10, verse 13 and verses 30 to 32. The word of the Lord was addressed to me as follows. Why do you keep repeating this proverb in the land of Israel? The fathers have eaten unripe grapes, and the children's teeth are set on edge. As I live, it is the Lord who speaks. There will no longer be any reason to repent. There will no longer be any reason to repeat this proverb in Israel. See now, all life belongs to me, the father's life, the son's life, both alike belong to me. The man who has sinned, he is the one who shall die. The upright man is law-abiding and honest. He does not eat on the mountains or raise his eyes to the idols of the house of Israel does not seduce his neighbor's wife or sleep with a woman during her periods. He oppresses no one, returns pledges, never steals, gives his own bread to the hungry, his clothes to the naked. He never charges usury on loans, takes no interest, abstains from evil, gives honest judgment between man and man, keeps my law, and sincerely respects my observances. Such a man is truly upright. It is the Lord who speaks. But if anyone has a son prone to violence and bloodshed, who commits one of these midsies, then the son shall certainly not live. Having committed all these appalling crimes, he will have to die and his blood be on his own head. House of Israel, in future I mean to judge each of you by what he does. It is the Lord who speaks. Repent, renounce all your sins, avoid all occasion of sins, shake off all the sins you have committed against me, and make yourselves a new heart and a new spirit. Why are you so anxious to die, house of Israel? I take no pleasure in the death of anyone. It is the Lord who speaks. Repent and live. The word of the Lord. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew Chapter 19, verses 13 to 15. People brought little children to Jesus for him to lay his hands on and say a prayer. The disciples turned them away, but Jesus said, Let the little children alone, and do not stop them coming to me. For it is to such as these that the kingdom of heaven belongs. Then he laid his hands on them and went on his way. The Gospel of the Lord.